Legends TV, this is the Den Daily bringing you all the latest gossip views and transfer news from in and around the Den. It really is all systems go in SE16 with no fewer than four signings through the door already. And yesterday, Gary Rowett came out in the press and said, I'm looking to add another two or three quality, quality players to those numbers. So really, really exciting times. And with the players we signed so far, it really does look like the club are finally trying to push on and they've got that belief that the fans have got that we can maybe, like we did in the 87 88 season, make the promised land once again. We probably only want it for one season, but what a season it would be with every kickoff probably 10 a.m. on a Sunday morning. But look, news has broken today that Millwall are interested in signing Everton's highly rated striker, Ellis Sims. Sims is from Oldham. He started his career in youth football at Blackburn, moved on to Manchester City and then landed at Everton in 2017 where he became a pro in 2020. Making one appearance for the Toffees. He's been out on loan at Blackpool where he scored eight goals in 21 games and most recently has spent time on loan north of the border at SPL side Hearts of Midlothian scoring seven goals in 20 appearances for the Tyne Castle side. I'm gonna say Tyne Castle, it just popped into my head. I'm not even sure if that's right. But we are going with it. And here's the catch. Hearts want him back. Hearts actually want to buy him. However, he is available to buy it. And the fee is believed to be around half a million pounds. Uh, it's the wage structure that's allegedly an issue for Hearts. And a number of names are being thrown into the hat with us leading the charge. The story has come to light through various media outlets, including The Sun and Football Scotland. So it definitely looks like it's got legs. Do we need a centre forward? Absolutely. Love Isaac Alafe, but I'm not sure that he's going to succeed at the club, if I'm honest, and that's not my feeling. I think that's the way the manager feels, and we've got to rely on him. He sees a lot more of the players than we do. Tom Bradshaw and Ben of course, good for us, but we need more up front. Someone posted the other day on social media, you know, our defenders, our midfielders, and our strikers, and our strikers did look a little bit like we do need more numbers. We do need an out-and-out -out striker, in my opinion. It looks like this guy could be the answer. Again, brilliant business if it's true. We're not going after journeymen. We're not going after people that were good once, but now not so much after being injured for three years. We're going after a young, hungry player that's come from good pedigree at Everton, proved himself at clubs he's been at by actually scoring goals. And if he can drop down that one division and join our club, I'm sure he'll be not only a great addition to the squad, but good competition for Bradders and Benikafobi. And as I said, things are really, really looking up. But yeah, there you go. The news today coming out of South Bermondsey is that Ellis Sims, Everton striker, is a mill target. So that's your lot for the Den Daily. Could be more shows out today. There is more news, but I might wait on that next one till tomorrow. I think you might know I'm talking about. If you don't, have a look on Twitter. Please subscribe to Lions TV. Come on, you lions.